Okay, this is Bonkai 922, and I just reviewed 400, I just watched, four, read 430 chapter of Bleach. And, um, like I said, I was going to say, uh, they just came out with the movie, so hyped up about that. Pretty interesting, looks good, seen a trailer of it. But I digress. This chapter, last week we got a name of the organization. Welcome to Execution. This time around, this chapter revealed some some more stuff. Now, I'm not going to sugarcoat this. I've been talking to people in, you know, school, my school at City Tech, and they think this is going to last a long time. My opinion, I'm going to agree with this one guy, I forgot his name, Crazy Gamer, I think. Big guy. Big black guy. Um, he was talking about it. He was saying that until 2015. But someone responded to one of my reviews and said, Oh, we're going into the Ishin arc. Now, we haven't seen Ichigo's father. I haven't seen him. At all. In this chapter, you get a lot of Urihime. <laughs> She's so cute. So funny. <laughs> But this chapter got a little grim. Because what happens is Ichigo, you know, there's this scene with Colleen and Yuzu, and um, Colleen's joking with Yuzu about something, and she runs away because you, you, Colleen said something bad about Ichigo, or so on and so forth. And Ichigo leaves the house and bumps into Orihime at the hospital where, where uh, Uyu is. Shida. And his father's there, and they're talking, and he had an injury. And everyone's talking to Ichigo as if, in like, why are you here? This is very troubling to me. Very troubling. Oh, by the way, it's Oscar. Um, very troubling. Very troubling. I don't understand what his angle is here. It's Kubo's angle. Well, what is he trying to do here? We've already established the fact that Ichigo doesn't have his powers anymore. And this chapter further amplifies that. Because, you know, uh, he's very depressed, Ichigo, at this point. He's really depressed. I'm talking down to the bottom. You know? Because this, at this point, because what happens is, he goes see Zulu at the hospital. And he has no, and he, you know, and he t screams at his father saying, shut up! Saying he was going to say something about, to Ichigo about something. And then his father says, like, some stupid now. I'm like, oh, if it was five um, decibels louder, your wound would have opened up. But anyway. When Ichigo leaves, Orihime says, Kurosaki, I'll see you in class tomorrow, blah, blah, blah. Don't, you know. Uliu's father tells Orihime that the Rizetsu that was on Uliu's wound was not of a hollow and was not of a Shinigami. He looks at her and he says it was of a human. Now, here's what we know now. We know the name of the organization. Welcome to Execution. And we know these people, they're human. And now, to further entice us, Ilyu's father says, well, he went after Ilyu, the next optional targets are you and Chad. He tells that to Orihime. And we then we see Ichigo slamming his fist on a pole, and he says, oh, he's so frustrated because he can't do anything. He has no power. He doesn't have his powers anymore. It's like, why is this happening? What, what? Listen. And then at the end of the chapter, we get, um... He calls these people. He calls the, the executions. And, he's, and he says, he calls them. He, their phone rings. I guess his cell phone. And he says his name, Ichigo Kurosaki. And you he he hear this name, this guy say, Mr. Kur Ichigo Kurosaki. Saying, like, this guy saying, greatly interested in you. And then on the side, it said something about how he's desperate now. Listen, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. 
I'm not going to sugarcoat this. There's no, there's no other optional reasoning behind this. But here we go. Naruto is getting better with the manga. Bleach has been watered down a few times, but I will say this. <sighs> Recently, I found out something shocking. I don't know if you guys, you guys probably have heard of this guy who did these videos called Shockweed. Well, I found out this past, I don't know, was it Wednesday, Tuesday? I got a video from on YouTube saying the end of Encore Party. And he stated that Bleach is no longer his favorite anime and he's done with it and he's going on to a new thing. Now, I agree with him. There is no more Encores. Why would you do Encore Party? It's so stupid. He's going to still do AMVs, so I'm happy about that. But, the fact is, I don't see myself pulling in the towel yet. Not yet. Regardless of what Kubo does with this show, regardless of how he manages it, I will say this. At least, we're going into a territory that does not involve Hollows or Shinigami. Hollows or Slow Reapers. So we're actually going into a different scenario here. Now, if this involves Ichigo's father, I can see this going in several ways. Now, explain this to me. Why the fuck are these people after Ichigo's friends? Because that doesn't make any sense. Ichigo doesn't have any powers. So why are they doing this? Why are they, they attack Uri? For what purpose? That's my beef. It seems to me like he has got next week, next week's chapter, Kubo has to do one thing. He has to tell us what the fuck these guys are after. And he has to tell us next week. I don't care. Make, it, make the manga like 24 pages if you have to. 24 or 25 or whatever. But tell us. What is their beef? What is their story? Why are they doing this? And if Uri's father is correct, the next targets are Chad and Uriene. They have no power? What are you... <laughs> it doesn't make sense, okay? You get this guy showing up out of nowhere with these the slobby hair. <laughs> I'm a guy with slobby hair. Give me a break. Man. But we'll see. I mean, at the moment, I'm not throwing in the towel this show. I told you people what my reasons were. They might be stupid reasons, but they're reasons nonetheless. And the reasons why? Number one, Bleach has had some great fight scenes. Both shows have great fights. So I just can't abandon that. It'd be dreadful. I can't, I can't, I know, you know Ichigo's getting his powers back. You know he is. Because who's going to fight these guys? Whoever the villain is, we'll find out. But I'm not abandoning the show because of, because of their great fights. You know? My second reason? Listen, you saw this chapter. You saw Orihime. You can't tell me, anybody can't tell me, that you don't love this character. She's a beautiful beautiful character. Taikuba has fucked up his story, but you know what? I love his taste in uh, her, the female. Because really think about this, there's no Rukia. And who do we have? We have Oriyama. And she is perfect. She like brings this sense of Worriness to Ichigo, and I really like the way she was animated, especially now with this long hair she has. Perfect, it's marvelous, tremendous. But like I said before, this is Bonkai 922. Um, I'll continue reading. I'm not. I'm. I. I, I am not going to stop 
I am not going to uh, ten minutes. I am not going to stop reading this show, and I'm not going to stop watching enemies. Chuckweed, he probably will, but I understand where he's coming from, and I understand how you know you can stick with the show and you just love that on car arc, and then all of a sudden we got this going on. Cool has got to get deeper. Last week. He gave us the name of the organization. The week before, a name of a guy. This week, we know what they are. Guess what? Next week, why don't you clue us in? Who the fuck are they? What do they want? What do they want? And what side are they on? Give us those two things. At least give us what they want. And what they want with Ichigo. Give us that. Please? Please? So, let's be Bug Guy Nine Twenty Two. Oh, by the way, I mentioned this before. January two thousand eleven. Supposedly they're coming out with Evan Two Point Zero Duck in theaters. So I'm interested in seeing that. Uh, next week, I will do a review. I will do a review, but it will be Thursday night. Thursday night. If I'm up to it. Next week I have finals. <laughs> Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, finals. Three finals in a row. Then the following Monday I have another final. And then I'm done. I hopefully will pass my math class. My math is just I fucking hate math. My other classes you should do well with too. So, this is Bronco 922. I'll see you guys later.